Hello students, welcome to the channel Top Gate. In this video, I will discuss one more problem of DFA that is to design a DFA that accepts all strings of A comma B which start with A and end with B. Now let's first understand what kind of language we have and then what is the shortest possible string that we can accept in this one and then we'll design a DFA for this one. Okay, so let's discuss about the language first. So in the language what we have, it is saying that the string should start with A and it should end with B. So what is the shortest possible string in this case? So shortest possible string can be that starts with A and ends with B. That is it is the shortest possible string. It should be accepted. Okay. Now apart from this what can be accepted? So it says that it should only start with A and it should end with B but in between these A and B I can have any combination of A B. Okay. Like we can have a a also we can have a b also we can have b b also we can have b a also so all these possibilities are there okay so we need to take care about all these past possibilities and the main concern is that it should start with a and end with b okay so since we know the shortest possible string in this case is a b therefore we'll design a dfa for this one first and then we'll try to incorporate all these options into that one since the length of this string is Two. So we have n plus 1 that is 3 states. So for this shortest possible string, I need to design a DFA that should contain at least 3 states. Okay, so let's design this DFA. We start with some initial state that is Q0. Okay, and at Q0, we give an input as A that it the string should start with A and we reach on to some state say Q1. Okay, and from Q1, I again move with the input B and we go to some state say Q2 and make it as final and we are done. Okay, So right now we are accepting AB that is it is starting with A, it is ending with B. Fine. Now to complete this DFA, we need to have exactly one path for every input from every state. Okay, Like on Q0, we have only one path that is for A. So I need a path for B. At Q1, I have only one path that is for B. I need a path for A. At Q2, I need a path for A and B both. Okay. Now let's come to this one. So at Q0, we have A and we have to add a path for B. Now if I add a path for B and with that path, I go to somewhere else. Fine. Now, how many options we have for adding B? Either I can add a self loop of B here or I can go to Q1 with B or I can go to Q2 with B. Okay. So in any case, in any case, if I add this B here or here or here, then in every case, this condition that the string should start with A is getting violated. Why? Because we can have B, B that is starting with B, ending with B. So ending with B is true, but starting with B is getting violated. Then again, in this way, like starting with Q0, I am accepting only B. That is, it is ending with B. That is correct. But again, it is not starting with A. If I take a self loop, that is B, A, B. So starting with B, ending with B, ending with B, it is correct. But it is not starting with A. That's why we cannot take B here. We cannot take B here. We cannot take B here. So what I'll do? So I need to do something like we can trap this B. We, we need to have B here. So what I'll do? I'll simply take a trap state like dead state I'll take. So say Q3 and whenever in the starting we have B, we trap it. Okay. And we go to state Q3 which is the dead state and with this Q3 I will never be able to go on to the final state. Okay. That is called as a dead state sometimes. Okay. So we are getting trapped whenever the B is coming on to the first position in the string. Okay. Now for Q we are done. For Q0 we are done. That is A path is there, B path is there. Now come to Q1. At Q1 we have a path for B but we don't have a path for A. So what options we have here to add a path for A? Either I can add a path of A here or I can add a path of A here or I can add a self loop of A here. Okay, So we need to check first of all what is the correct one. Now if I take this that is if I come with A to Q0 okay? so and the string is A, A, B 
okay so we have a a b that is it is starting with a it is ending with b so it should be technically accepted okay but let's see in this one we started with this one q naught a a and then b so with a a b i am going on to the trap state i am getting trapped i am not able to go on to the final state therefore this string is not getting accepted therefore this transition is failed it is not a correct one now let's check this one suppose we add this a here so what i'll do suppose i have a uh, string as a a okay so we have a a so it should not be accepted it is starting with a but it is not ending with b therefore it should not be accepted but a a so it is getting accepted therefore this transition is also not correct okay now suppose if if we have this one okay so with this one you check this one it should be accepted fine so we come with this one q0 to q1 with a then again this a then again this b so a a b is getting accepted though this is getting passed now check this one a and then a so we are not going on to the final state therefore this string is getting rejected therefore the correct method is this only that we have to add a self loop of a on q1 okay so we'll do that so now q0 is complete q1 is complete now come to q2 at q2 it is saying that the string should end with b and it should start with a so now it, it is starting with a but it should end with b so i what i can have the string suppose we have as a b b b b okay it is starting with a ending with b so that is what i can do here i can add a self loop of b here that is a b b b b is getting accepted now what about a what to do with a i need a path for a so this path for a has three options either i can add a here or i can add a here or i can add a here or i can add a here now what is the correct one if i add a on this one okay if i add a on this one that is this one on going on to the trap state so what i'll do that is suppose we have a string as a b a b okay that is it is starting with a ending with b so it should be accepted so let's check it out a b a and we are getting trapped we are going going on to the trap state dead state so this string is not accepting so therefore this transition is not correct so i will remove this one so let's check this one now first one that is from q2 we are coming to q0 so suppose we have a uh, string again as a b a b so let's check it out a b then a and b so again we are going on to the dead state therefore this string is not getting accepted again therefore this transition is again wrong now if i add a here suppose that is self loop of a suppose i have a string as a b a so a b and a so it is getting accepted however this string should not be accepted why because it is ending with a fine so adding a self loop of a is also not correct now let's check this one that is if i add a transition of a at this point now if we have this string that is a b a b okay check this one a b a we are not on to the final state therefore this string is getting accepted and this is getting rejected therefore this transition seems to be a correct one okay so now q0 is complete q1 is complete q2 is complete come to q3 at q3 we have a dead state therefore there is no issue so what i'll do i'll simply add a self loop that is a comma b and we are done so this is a dfa for accepting all the strings of ab that start with a and end with b right thank you so much